guys, it's Nathan with American West Realty and I'm standing in front of 414 East 8th Street in Powell. This is a duplex with a three bedroom, two bath in front and then a three bedroom, two bath in the back. Both with some real nice upgrades. These are really great units. Uh, they've got garages in the back. A lot of really neat features so I expect they're not going to last long. I'm going to flip this camera around and show you the neighborhood and then I'll take you through a tour of the inside of each unit. All right, so for the front unit, we've got an entrance right here, as well as an entrance on the side. And then this is the door leading to the garage for the front unit. The second unit has an entrance right there. It also has a separate entrance to the backyard. And then the entrance for the garage is actually from the inside of the unit, which is very convenient. You got the high school down there. It's a nice, quiet residential street, with the exception of the wind that's probably blowing in the microphone. Let's go take a look inside. Okay, this is 414. This is the front unit, and I'm going to start here, even though this is the back of the house. This door will lead to the side of the house, and if you turn left, it takes you out to the garage and the alleyway. So there's a separate exterior door uh, that is secure. It will take you into the one-car garage. So downstairs, you've got this big family room. Over here is dining room, and there's a pass-through window into the kitchen there on the left. You got a pretty good-sized coat closet here, and a real bonus: check out the size of this storage pantry or storage room or whatever you would use it for. Tons of space in there. Again, big family room. This is the second family room. There's another one upstairs. Next to the kitchen, we've got this big storage pantry with two pull-out drawers. And these cabinet doors takes you underneath to the crawl space. A good portion of it is about right to there, in the middle of the screen. You can see the pavement ends. Lots of room for storage. This is the control for the intercom system and radio that works throughout the house. And here is the kitchen. Again, a pass-through window right there behind the sink that can pass food through to the dining area. Lots of nice cabinet space. This includes a refrigerator, microwave, oven, and dishwasher. All newer appliances. We've got nice luxury vinyl plank throughout the kitchen and family room. And then down here, we have a three-quarter bath. It's a storage closet. This contains an ironing board and iron built in. Here is your laundry hookups, washer and dryer. It's electric, not gas. The vanity. And then back here we've got a shower and a toilet. So three quarter bath on that level. Now walking up here, this is the main floor. Again, nice luxury vinyl plank. You got some built-in bookshelves in the living room. Nice tall ceilings, big bright windows. Got another standard coat closet here. And one bedroom on the main floor. This bedroom's pretty good size. You got some built-in drawers there room for a TV or something. Two big windows. And a nice closet. Then upstairs we have two more bedrooms and a full bath. This is a linen closet. We've got one bedroom here. This is just additional storage space up in the attic. see newer paint, newer flooring throughout. I think all the paint and flooring is about a year, year and a half old. 
kitchen is a little bit dated, but in a really cool way. Look at that matching bathtub, sink, and even a purple toilet. They knew how to do it back in the 70s. And then, nice little surprise, lots of storage back here. And those are really deep drawers and cabinets. system throughout the house and that is it for 414 East 8th Street all right we're gonna do a quick walk through 414 and a half 8th Street in Powell the winds opening the door for us this door is to a garage for the front unit but there is parking in back around the garage I'll show you that in a different clip and this one has direct access from the garage right into the unit, so. Beautiful vinyl plank flooring, new paint, new carpet. The little carpet's about a year old. Big bright windows. This large uh, space under the stairs with the furnace and the water here. Lots of storage space in the kitchen. We've got all the appliances, fridge, stove, microwave, dishwasher. <clears throat> and back here we have laundry room with a big utility sink. Of course it's right next to the kitchen so that'd be handy for some additional prep space. Then you've also got a shower and a toilet, so essentially a three-quarter bath. This unit has four stair heat and central air conditioning. Take a look at the garage. This is a real bonus. Just a one-car door on an opener. Look at the size of that. It's essentially the size of a two-car garage. Lots of storage and workspace. You could put a freezer out here or something. Got the electrical for it. And you've also got a fenced yard off here to the side with a big patio. There's a condenser for the air conditioner. The yard goes along the side of the house a little bit as well. So big patio. This would be on the shady side of the house in the evening time walk through gate to go back to the garage or the alley with the garbage and again there's room back there to park a couple cars without having to uh, park in the front of the building and walk in now let's take a look at the upstairs We've got this nice bonus room I would call it storage it could be an office space no windows, just this one door and a vinyl floor. We've got this nice big open landing. Over here is the largest bedroom. And we will have the floor plan on our website as well so you can see the actual square footage of each size or the size of each room. But this is a pretty big one and take a look at these closets extra deep. I know it's kind of hard to see on my camera here, but those are extra deep closets. Here we have a full bath. Another pretty large bedroom. Not quite as big as the master, but still larger than normal. Bright window. And then we have this small room here which does not have a closet in it. It still could be used for a kid's room or a playroom or a man cave or something. So again, that's 414 and a half, 8th Street in Powell. So there you go guys, two of our newest rentals on East 8th Street in Powell. 
These are really nice units, so I expect they're not going to last very long. Uh, if you want to schedule a time to see these, if you want to see our other rentals, or if you want to start the application process, all of that can be done online at our website. Check out AmericanWestRealty.com or give us a call at 307-587-9608. Thanks.